Andrew Bridges and I'm here with uh, the University of Denver on an international finance trip to Brussels and London. And we just got to meet Catherine Siller, who's a member of the European Parliament and she represents Scotland. And she gave us an amazing perspective on Brexit and uh, privacy laws and copyright. Today we're here in the EU Parliament. This is a, uh, one of the meeting rooms. It's very interesting actually being here and experiencing a professional environment. It's uh, um, actually being able to be involved in these meetings. Well, it's the first day of the London portion of our Brussels and London trip. And this morning we met with one of our University of Denver alums. So one of the things the students are learning about is what you need to do to prepare for new careers and how the education process can work towards it. I've been getting used to taking the trains around here and uh, London is a bit of a complex system but it is sure a big help. We just got done talking um, with Esther Gilmore who is the client representative here at Generation um, and they're all about sustainable investing. It was really cool to find that they care about the fashion industry and what that looks like for uh, fair labor, but then they also care about the food industry um, and what that looks like for nutrition. We've been at several companies uh, getting great exposure to different kinds of businesses, investment management, private equity, uh, and a couple of law firms. Great to be on a trip like this because you meet so many uh, important people with such a wide network. This program is a part of the Daniels Finance Program, visiting different companies uh, like private equity companies and uh, asset management companies. My favorite visit is going to be the Lloyd's Insurance. What makes this program great is the opportunity that students have to learn from the top level executives that they met with in Europe. They learn about how the European markets work, they learn about the political process, they learn about the business environment for Europe and especially as it even does apply to the rest of the world.